Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. In this video, we'll be talking about the Pilatus PC-12 airplane. Please remember to like and subscribe. Now let's get right into it. Fact 1. Pressurized turboprop. When you see a propeller plane, especially single engine propeller planes like this, most of them aren't pressurized. What this means is that they can only fly at relatively low altitudes. In fact, the FAA requires if the altitude of the airplane is over 15,000 feet, they are required to have oxygen for the pilot and the passengers. And the reason is simple. At that level of altitude, oxygen is very thin, and so you need supplemental oxygen in order to avoid hypoxia. The Pilatus PC-12, however, is pressurized. This is similar to most commercial large jetliners such as Boeing 737, 667s, or Airbus 320s kind of thing, where the entire cabin is pressurized so it can maintain a sea level pressure within the cabins and the cockpit, but cruising at 30,000 feet. This is an important distinction for Pilatus PC-12 compared to other propeller airplanes. Fact 2. Large cargo door. Another cool feature of the PC-12 is the large cargo door toward the aft of the airplane. The cargo door opens upwards and reveals a huge opening for people to either transport cargo or for passengers to get into the airplane. There is still a door behind the cockpit as the normal passenger door and also for pilots, but the rear cargo door is another additional benefit of this aircraft. In the passenger configuration, again, passengers can use this door to get into the airplane. In the cargo configuration, the cargo door is useful to load heavy things or large things into the airplane. Can you imagine squeezing something really wide through the main door in the front? It'll probably be really complicated. And so the PC-12 is a very versatile aircraft that could be a fully passenger-only aircraft or for cargoes transportation. Great, let's get into the next fact. Fact 3. UA-28A Draco. The UA-28A Draco is the military's designation for the PC-12. In fact, it is actually the exact same airplane with, of course, some military required modification from the United States Air Force. However, it's essentially the same plane with the same engine and the same size, wingspan, and so forth. Several United States Air Force Special Operations Groups use this as the primary aircraft. They're all mostly based out of the Canyon Air Base and is consisted of many of these aircraft, usually painted in military gray colors and used for special military operations. They're probably not used for any military combat operations because this plane cannot really be fitted with any sort of armaments. So it is likely to be used in special transport operations. And by transport, I mean transport of people and cargo. Because think about it, this type of airplane is so similar to other general aviation airplanes that it could possibly go undetected with a new paint scheme and allow the United States to conduct secret operations or clandestine operations without being noticed. Cool, let's get into the next fact. Fact 4. Unpaved runways. A very, very important feature of the PC-12 is its ability to land in unpaved runways. In fact, any strip of land that's relatively flat with no obstructions, the PC-12 can land there. This is one of the most important features of this aircraft and one of the major selling points. The whole reason that this aircraft was so popular is because the ability to fly into places where there are no paid runways. And so this increases the places that the PC-12 can reach dramatically. Any kind of runway, as long as it's flat, without too many obstructions, can be used. And so the PC-12 can land in fields, farms, deserts, or any kind of gravel area. 
and does not need a proper airport to take off and land. And this is especially important when people use the PC-12 to reach disaster areas where there are no functioning airports. They could fly in using the cargo configuration and land at a non-paved runway and simply unload the humanitarian or rescue cargo quickly. It's what makes the PC-12 such a versatile aircraft. Fact 5. Over 8 million hours. The PC-12 is so popular that as of May 2021, it has logged over 8,000 flight hours. This is up to the same level of flying as other corporate jets. Again, as I mentioned in the previous section, the PC-12 is super popular among general aviation people because it allows the pilots to land at places that don't have a major paved runway. Can you imagine all the remote areas that you could reach with the PC-12? If you lived in, say, backcountry Alaska or middle of nowhere Montana, you can use the PC-12 and as long as you have a big enough backyard where it has a long strip of clear land, you can keep this aircraft and use this aircraft to take off and land in that area. A lot of the other propeller and turboprop airplanes require a paved runway, and as such, many GA pilots regard the PC-12 as one of the most versatile aircraft ever built and so it remains hugely popular even today with continued production. Great, that's it for my video. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. See you next time.